I'm Martin Beck. I'm a scientist from the Max Planck Institute of Biophysics. I think it has become pretty clear that a single technique alone is not sufficient to solve the really big biological questions. And um, integrative structural biology will continue to become more important. And one has to think about techniques that are facilitators of data integration, which means they allow us to bring different types of data together. And what I have in mind there is, for example, cross-linking mass spectrometry that is very powerful in measuring spatial proximity. Another one is cryo-electron tomography that uh, puts, so to say, the molecular parts into the context of the cell. And uh, it's worthwhile to focus on the integrating techniques. I think that modeling small cellular systems or like subcellular segments of eukaryotic cells to the best of our knowledge based on experimental data but still in silico will be a powerful way to hypothesize and conceive in the future and that is the direction that we should think into. We need modern structures for data sharing and findability. It's very important uh, to make data accessible to the whole scientific community. I think locally in the institutes we do need free access to an array of technologies, not necessarily all the technologies in a single place, but a, a healthy combination of different technologies that is available to all scientists in a certain place. And this is how the future institutes uh, should look like, and I think then they can be very successful. Training is very important. It's important to run courses uh, that allow a scientist to enter into a new technique that they haven't been using before. But I think it's also very important to have the local support. We, we need staff scientists that are specialized in getting people into a certain technology in, in order to enable them to be successful.